All right, everyone. I know you're on deadline, but listen up. Got some big news. Here's our headline in every one of our tabloids across the country tomorrow. Green and gold. That's right. News Corp is now committed to net zero emissions by 2050. Climate change is real. <laughs> Sorry, but our orders have come from the top. What? From Murdoch? No, Harvey Norman. Look, if we don't move with the times, we'll be net zero advertisers by 2050. So from now on, we're going to report the facts on climate change and back it up with science. Oh this is bullshit! OK, can everyone please stop jumping out the window? I get it. This is confusing. Now, we've spent two decades actively undermining any pro-climate policy in this country. Then we become a fully-fledged, tree-hugging, greeny publication overnight. Except you, Andrew. You still get your daily column. You can write whatever you want. Now, some of you might be thinking, hang on, aren't we the media organisation that destroyed five Prime Ministers over climate policy? Wasn't it four? No, we killed Kevin twice, remember? Greatest moral challenge of our generation. Well, we are now a news company who agrees with Kevin Rudd. <laughs> that was a fair response. But just because we're pro-climate now, that doesn't mean we have to change the way we go about things. So I still want to see bad puns, dog whistling and emotionally manipulative photos of tradies in high-vis vests. Can we still Photoshop Anthony Albanese to look like a Nazi? Sharon, not only can you do that, but I expect you to. <laughs> it's in your KPIs. At least one Nazi Photoshop per month. <sighs> Look, I know it's not easy working in this building, towing the line, with our families asking us how we sleep at night. But we all know what the answer is. On a latex mattress with 2,000 thread count Egyptian cotton sheets, thanks to a half-yearly sale at Harvey Norman. And Mr Harvey, great to have you here. Now, this, this is a moment of introspection for our organisation. If we were wrong about climate change, what else might we have been wrong about? Are African gangs really taking over our cities? Has political correctness really gone mad? Are the burgers really better at Hungry Jacks? Oh, I just don't know anymore. But you know one thing we've never been wrong about? There's an incredible washer-dryer combo from Harvey Norman on page three. Yay! With how many months interest-free? 60 months! And how do I know this? Cos it's written in big font! And how big is the font? Huge! And why is that? Cos we're News Corp and we're for sale! Yeah! That's the hard bit done. Now to convince the government. 